we're really excited for this weekend. Um, it's something that we look forward to all year. So we get here in August. Uh, I think we moved in August 8th this year. Um, so we have a long time of preparation to get to March 4th. Um, so all year, especially during football season, we prep for this, um, especially game day. We kind of start choosing the stunts um, for cheerleading that we think we're going to use in our competition routine. Um, and we always set a goal. So our ending pyramid this year um, was a goal we had last year. We did um, a little different version of it last year and we said we wanted to build on it for this season. Um, so seeing that actually work out has been very, very exciting. Um, that pyramid is, it takes a lot of skill. It takes a lot of athletes to do it. Um, we utilize every single one of our athletes on the map for that pyramid. So I think that's, that's the most important exciting part and special part of the routine is that ending pyramid because we have been working for it and working towards it and now and now it's here and it's working out great. Um, our dance team has grown so much over the last four years. Um, this is their first time competing. Uh, most of our athletes on our dance team did compete at the high school level, but this will be their first time competing in college. Um, it's fun to see them pick a theme. So this year's theme is Britney Spears, um, which we brought out with our red palms and they have worked incredibly hard to get this routine where it is. Um, we had a phenomenal choreographer, uh, Carissa Wilson, do our routine, and she utilized each one of our athletes and utilized each one of their strengths. Um, so getting them to see them compete versus doing sidelines is awesome. Um, they're versatile and they can do all different things, and so we're very excited to see them showcase that this weekend.